Well, welcome back, viewers, to the Graceful Tales F. Okay, so I did some grinding since the last part, and obviously enough, everybody's gained at least from five to seven levels. I've mastered a number of different titles for each character, which this is what I wanted to get out right away. I did... Okay, I didn't master. I know I can go beyond level five and master an ability, and there's a... From what I've heard, there's titles available for when you master enough abilities, but I'm not going to do that just yet. I will eventually, though, when I do another grinding session. Also, I've taken the liberty of manually playing with each and every character just so I can get a feel of their battle styles. That way, if I ever have to switch because Asbel faints, or if I ever feel like I need to take control of somebody else for a particular situation to really exploit an enemy's uh, weakness, then me knowing how to play the different characters is going to help. And let me just tell you, I love playing Malik. I'm just going to put it right now. I think besides Asbel, Malik might be my best character in playing, playing with. So we are in the Strata Craig's, Craglands and we are going to progress with the plot. We'll still fight enemies along the way though. Let's do this. Because I have nothing better to do. Okay, you're gone. <clears throat> yeah, I have to say the different battle styles of the enemy or of my allies. Very interesting. Sophie's is a bit complex for me. Or at least it's a bit hard for me to really comprehend and utilize to the fullest. Can somebody heal me? Thank you. What's our motto? Oh come on. I wanted to be healed before we go into this. <laughs> Obviously enough, I can't I can't t like talk for long periods of time and fight. I get my ass kicked. Do I have I don't have any grilled chicken. <laughs> Courtesy of Ghost Trickster, I now know that each character has a specific favorite item, and there's a title available if I feed them that enough. <laughs> love my viewers. Just love them. Giving me all this advice that I wouldn't have figured out on my own, or I might have figured out like 50 parts later. Stand guard. Okay. So you guys are a relief to me there. Definite relief. And I really appreciate all the positive okay. feedback and comments, you know. I'm starting to notice that this is... I think this is becoming a very popular playthrough with you guys. I see a lot of comments, a lot of likes, and I really appreciate it. Each every each and every bit really helps with the build-up and development of the channel, so... <laughs> Much obliged. Holy shit. Thank you, Malik. Let's keep moving. Also, obviously enough, I've done some dualizing, some manipulation of equipment. I think I got something better for Malik, actually. Um, I believe I gave him a rune tunic? Uh, no, I got a second rune tu tunic for Ch Sharia. So yeah, I've been busy since the last video. It's all, I'm also glad to know that I wasn't supposed to go to the right path to begin with, and, you know, until later. Because those enemies are ridiculous. They do, like, tens of thousands of damage. I'm guessing I'm not going to be ready for that for a long time. And somebody on my friends list went offline. <laughs> Stampede Strike! So, so far I've seen... I've seen everybody's Elif Burst except for Sharia's and Hubert's. Actually, does Sharia even have one? Sorry guys, I have to take a look. Um, Okay, she has... I believe it's Reaper's Toll. No, no, it's Critical Blade. Switch it back to Otto. He has Calamity Rondo. Emerald Strike. 
Oh yeah, she, yes, she, yes, she does. Asterism, asterism line. I've never used it before, though. Sherry is probably my weakest in terms of usage, and quite frankly, her abilities don't seem to really do that well out here because I don't know. The others, like Malik and stuff, have freeze abilities, and as you can see, quite a few enemies have freeze weaknesses. Ugh, these bitches are the most annoying shit. Even in battle, it's important to pay your respects. Okay. Mm, not like that. This? No way. <laughs> Never mind. I don't think you guys saw that one yet. Sophie is just the cutest thing ever, I have to say. Alright, so I talked to these people. I really have nothing to say. I have to say that grinding session was really promising. You know, getting practice with other characters. This is something I never did back in Star Wars until the ends of time or uh, the Lost, the Last Hope. I believe that's what it's called. You could always switch to other characters, but I always stuck with the main protagonist. So I never got to experience it from another character's perspective, and it's really cool, actually. Really, really fun. Oh yeah, and in terms of requests, the only one I haven't done is I have to make a hamburger. And quite frankly, I do not know how to make a burger. Well, I do know how to make a burger, I just need to find the right ingredients. Oops. Ah, frozen bitch. Oh shit, it's in its elf burst. Just the pen, I cannot. Yeah, I can't like stagger it or anything. God, I just said stagger. I've been watching a lot of Final Fantasy 13 2 videos. I guess the rumors are true. I really am that awesome. Yes, you are, Pascal. That's why you're still on my team, and I haven't replaced you. Alright, let's keep moving. Alright, Cacnea. Aw, man! Thought I could switch to another character and use their uh, mystic art. I have been saying arts, right? I'm really trying. I'm really trying to do the vocabulary ju justice. Someone who's so smart they can control air with their mind. Wow, you're amazing. God, it's two thirty in the morning, and I have like an abundance of energy. It's kind of creepy, actually. I'm a creeper. Well, where did you come from? Every level will help. There we go. These enemies are like a piece of cake now. Ow! And immediately I get bitch slapped by a cacnea. Stop doing that! So annoying. Let's keep moving. Mm, I got some fancy fur. Mm, yes, go ahead. Let's see if Sharia's thing is ready. Yes. Just want to give her as many new arts as I can as I go. No new art. Ah, here we go. Lightning blast. And it also improves my healing circle. Hell yeah. See, my whole goal with the art system, the title system, is to always go for the titles that have new arts. That way, whenever I find enemies with different weaknesses or a specific one I need to exploit, I can do that. Okay. Go for the go for the wizards first. They're the most annoying little shits. 
think I can finish you off right away. Yeah, I'm running this through your ass. It will take more than that to stand in our way. Ah, Malik. You're turning into my favorite character for combat. Besides Asbel. I should actually I should actually play uh Malik a bit, shouldn't I? Show you guys what I can do, even though it's been a while since I recorded. Nope. Here we go. Alright. Most important thing is to keep distance. Hold down the button, hit X. There we go. There we go. Oh! Little bitch. You're dead. Bam! Finish him off. Ah. Right. I did it. Go me. There she goes again. Okay. And I got like a shit ton of tutorial boxes like that when I used the other characters because it took me 50 parts to finally do it. Right. Oh. 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 Stuck his horn up my butt! <laughs> and switch to Malak! Go team! This is what happens when you misjudge your foe. So just to give you guys an idea of what my uh, Malak's arts are for when I play manually, obviously enough, cold. Cold Front and Ice Spires are in the front. I have my Photon Burst because that's actually really, really good. Deathmire takes a long time to charge, but my god. And the fact that it can also inflict slow is really good too. You can just tell I'm really getting into this. Ooh, an anklet. Uh, what does this give? Near death equals critical rate plus 25%. And it still increases. I like... I want to stick with the items that increase my stats. Hey, and a save point. Give. Okay, seriously dude, get out of my face. You're about to hurt. Ow, ow, ooh, ooh. Back it up. There we go. Damn, you finished them both off. Ooh. Malik, man. Remind me never to piss you off. Phantom Pulse. Uh, increases Dagger Strike and Demon Fang. Demon Fang attack, Concussive Ball Fan. I'm trying to use this a lot. Oh! Demon Fist! St I still use Demon Fang, so that, that could help. Oh shit, and also Malak. Um, Ice Spires. Hmm. Oh, here we go. Let's increase the capabilities of my Ice Spires. More accuracy, chance of HP recovery. Gives me more evasion, too, so... Can't tell... <clears throat> Can't tilt your nose up at that. Got a nice can of cola. We are good to go. Stand guard. Okay. 
I'm just like in abundance of joy right now. I'm like. Oh no! <laughs> uh, thank you, Zoe. <laughs> Did this dragon just juke me earlier? Why the pigtails, Sophie? Pig tails? Alright. Moving on to the next town. Cool tower. We seem fine so far, but isn't that Rocka whatever up ahead? Sable Isole, the city of scholars. Let's ask around. The town people should know something. That sounds like a good idea. Looks like a pretty quaint town. I would never live here though, because I don't want to be have my house dangling, you know. Above a freaking gorge. No thanks. Have you ever seen the Rockagong? He strikes such a powerful presence. I wish I had a chance to dissect. You prick. Then again, you are a researcher. I should not be surprised. Do you know what a man truly needs in his life? Yes, exactly. Nice hot spices. Everyone needs spice in their life, and I got a little something to help you along. Fiery tongue warming spices. That's what a man needs. Mmm. I love spicy food. This guy just hooked me up. How do I get here? I have a feeling I'm supposed to talk to you. I can't imagine it has something to do with that happy face. Let me go around here first. More seeds for when we go back to, um, Lant. Oh, we can buy some items. Charge the mixer. Actually, I want to check something. What was I going to check? Holy crap. Um, oh, yeah, yeah, my mixer. See, I'm making grilled ch chicken. Um, I'll keep those three up. I don't even ha have any panacea bottles. Huh. Alright, let's see what you want. Do you know about, about Magic Carta? There are a series of cards that contain heroes from different worlds. Come see me when you have at least ten and we can play a game. If you look around, you can probably find a few cards right here in Sable Isole. Huh. The cards I have finally coming in handy? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven... Ooh, I, have, I just need two cards, and he said there's a couple around here, so... Let's go looking for some, right? Equipment. Um, which shop do I want to look at first? Let's go to items. Buy those. Do I have any items that are worth selling? Nope. Otherwise they'd be at the top. Okay, so let's think about this. I need a hamburger. Hamburger. That makes dried curry. Where's the food? Where's the food? Tomato, borscht, omelets, tomato parfait. Mmm! I've never had a parfait before, but I want to. Sandwich? I need a... I need a hamburger, man. Salisbury steak? Potato stew, potato stew, croquettes, baked potatoes. Oh, they, I'll give I'll give the game creators credit. They put a lot of attention into all this. Ooh, let's make some grilled a grilled chicken bowl. I'm just going through the whole thing. One of these has to be it. Meat pie. Wouldn't be any of these. Uh, 
I don't know how to make a hamburger. If I don't figure it out by the time, by the end of the episode, any chance any of you guys can tell me how to make a hamburger? Or what the two dualized ingredients are? Here we go. Whoa! That was weird. Um, doesn't improve. Ooh, that thoroughly improves Pascal. Gives her higher CC, but it reduces her accuracy like no, like a mother. Right, reduces Sophie's evasion. Or, <clears throat> yeah, reduces her evasion. Huh. Let's get one of those. And we'll equip her with the moon blouse. <clears throat> Alright, now I'm gonna go do some dualizing, so I shall be back momentarily. <laughs> 